Well, uh, good day to you. Um, my name is Tom Back from uh, Alcons Audio. Uh, Alcons Audio is a uh, relatively newcomer to the market. And we are a Dutch company founded in end of 2002. We manufacture professional sound systems and uh, we're going to explain a bit on the products we have on the stand today on the Plaza Show in London. Um, we're one of the speaker manufacturers. We operate in the, the higher end of the market and the reason we can claim uh, an excellent sound quality of our systems is the uh, we use proprietary pro ribbon technology. Um, some of you pro ribbon may uh, ring a bell of the old days of the ribbon technology. Uh, this is what we call pro ribbon technology. Uh, it's a professional specification uh, planar driver and it looks like this this is what we call a 601 it's a six inch pro ribbon driver and um, in this case it's a, a unit that has a, a thousand watt peak power handling it has a frequency range of one kilohertz to 20 kilohertz flat and uh, we apply different versions of this 601 platform in the different products we have and the different products we have are based on three philosophies it's uh, one is point source as you can see here this is a typical 8 inch with a high frequency driver unit and uh, it features a 401 pro ribbon driver 800 watt peak power handling pro ribbon driver uh, and an uh, 8 inch base reflex loaded box. It's actually a system that we would call our reference system because it's uh, very compact, first of all, but it sounds uh, actually as a, a studio monitor. So, in that sense, we call it the reference monitor. Okay, so we had a point source system, which we call the VR8. Uh, by the way, we do have a version that's called the VR12 with the 12 inch. Uh, what we would call point source. Another solution we develop is line array. Uh, as probably most of you are aware, line array has been a very popular uh, instrument in the toolbox of the sound engineer over the last, increasing in popularity over the last 10 years at least. Um, and with the uh, downscaling of the systems, also line, line array has gone quite smaller in, in system size. Uh, this is what you see is uh, the, the LR14. It's a double six and a half inch woofer uh, with again the 401 Pro Ribbon driver, and that one is mounted on uh, a 120 by 15 degree waveguide, what we would call a morpher waveguide so it controls the projection of the wavefront very well and uh, there's also a choice of a 90 by 15 degree waveguide so 15 degree in the vertical plane the coupling plane and 90 or 120 degrees in the horizontal plane um, the system is uh, modular that means you can have a, a line array as a full range uh, you can have the line array with the ground stacked sub you can have the line array with the flown base the LR14B which you see over there above the LR14 and you can also use um, the system with a ground stack sub and a flown LR14 base and the LR14 itself that would be what we would call the high power setup of the LR14 uh, the system rating in terms of safety is a, a 10 to 1 safety rating with even 24 cabinets in one array and um, again ultimate wave front uh, coherency because of first of all the pro ribbon cylindrical wave front and second of the morpher that controls the output projection of uh, of the cabinet okay so we just described the uh, lr14 we also have now the LR7, which is uh, what we would call uh, the micro designed pro ribbon line array. And um, a special feature is it's, uh, it's a single 6.5 inch woofer with again the 401 pro ribbon driver. Uh, it's a very compact, unobtrusive designed lightweight system. One box is about 8 kilo, so that means a, a total array 
uh, is well 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 under uh, 50 kilograms um, you can see again as with the LF14 you can build up the array with either an LF7B a ground stack sub or and an LS7B and a ground stack sub and make a, a, a full range system out of it. Um, it's specifically designed uh, for audio visual applications because it's a smaller size. Uh, the low end output goes again as the all the other line arrays from 74 Hz up to 20 kHz flat and the crossover point is like 1200 Hz. Um, and as you can see uh, because of the micro compact size it's also possible to put a line array on a stick. This is uh, something we're showing here for the first time. Uh, it's also for the first time in the industry that it's possible to put a complete curvable line array system on a stand mount like you see here, maintaining full curvature of the array. So that means you can create either a flat wavefront and then uh, the vertical dispersion will be roughly between 10 to 15 degrees or open five cabinets up with each 15 degree dispersion up to 75 degrees vertical dispersion uh, and every setting available in between. Uh, the total weight of the array in this case is 40 kilos so stays well within the working load limit of a normal regular in this case K&M stand.